everybody, Guy here with Total Geek Live, and as always, it's the TGL crew. We have Baltimore, Danny, and Kaiser. Voice Octave all the way up there. Uh, so anyway, we're going to be watching the trailer for, actually it's more of a teaser this time, it's more like teaser trash, I guess, but it's for Incredibles 2, more Incredibler. I think someone's already excited. Electric or boogaloo Kaiser's like, oh, this is Christmas, man. he's excited. But if you've been living in a cave, this is the sequel to the 2004 Pixar film. So this is our first look at the new trailer at. So let's go check it out. All right. So I've got the trailer window. Nope. That's going to the video. I mean, my email. Nope. That's going there. There it is. There it is. There it is. There you are, your little window. Yep, there's the little window. Let me back it up. Come on, Danny, Danny. All right, so I'm going Mr. to hit the play button now. He's broken the fourth wall. Yeah, so he can... What can't he do? Teleport or something? Or he was jump... Crazy. So he's got some dimensions. Okay, yeah, so let's count it. That's two. Two. That, that's a cool way to create the logo. It, yeah, I agree. Yeah. It's a very nice way to do the logo. You yeah. have powers! <laughs> yeah, baby! Three. Let, Four. Four, yeah. Oh, God. <laughs> oh, that's smart. Wow! And that, that was my impression of a horn hit. That little, <laughs> <laughs> that little laugh is infectious. Oh my god! Yeah. <laughs> so great. Oh, thank you guys. <laughs> <laughs> You're welcome, guys. Of course. So I'm pretty excited about this. Um, you know, Pixar is one of the few companies that can actually make a sequel that's as good as the original. Cars notwithstanding, but, you know, they got to make their big money somehow. Huh. Uh, but after seeing uh, the Finding Nemo sequel, Finding Dory, there's no doubt in my mind that they can put out sequels to all their classic early films. And this one was a lot of fun. This was a great superhero team. It was, and this is puts the tease in the teaser trailer because that's all that was. It's like, hey, you remember how much you love Jack-Jack? <laughs> well, look, he's going to be a big part of this one. Or is he? I don't know. We're teasing you. Yeah. Right. 14 years in the making. I am ready for this to be here now. Like, now, now. <laughs> yeah, I, I was ready about 10 years ago. Oh, gosh, yes. Yeah. So is this a Given Jack Jack hasn't aged, apparently, is he a forever baby? Is that one of his powers as well? Or <laughs> right. I guess we'll know when we is... see the kids. Yeah. The way this is set up, this is a direct right. After That's right. That's the... right. It takes place right. I mean, that fight, the mole man comes up right. The underminer. Underminer. Like underminer. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Cliff Clavin and Cheers. So uh, you got oh, kind of that voice there. Right. That's right. Okay. So Underminer is going to be the big bad for this one, and this is right after the events of when the Underminer revealed himself. So we're going to get the next big battle, and you know that, that's one of the cool things about it, as well as getting to see their day-to-day -day normal normal life as a family. <laughs> right. Yeah, well, you know. I, I've got an idea. They could just let the Underminer babysit Jack-Jack, and then, hey... Right. It's all done. <laughs> Problem yeah. solved. <laughs> yeah. That, yes. That... Least, what Jack has? Jack, Jack has at least four powers here, and right. And, it, and if you remember one, from the first movie, like he turned himself into lead, I think because right. he was so heavy. Or yeah. Some type of heavy metal. And then he turned into like that that um, demon baby thingy. Right. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Um. So do you think it might be centered around his godlike powers, like the uber super, like and try to be taken by a, a big bad or something? Maybe he was, yeah, maybe maybe the villain will try to take him. I think part of it with them being a family, it will be them trying to handle 
a baby with multiple powers. Because right, yeah. Because at this point, we're never, you know, this is the first time we're introduced to a super that has more than one power. Mm-hmm. Um, right? Because pretty much, yeah. Mr. Incredible was just strong. Yeah. yeah. He couldn't fly oh, or... I'm have with that, like, the healing and resilience and stuff. Right, but again, yeah. we're getting the perfect Fantastic Four movie. <laughs> Yeah. Right, so the baby's a crawl? <laughs> no, the baby is <laughs> a scree or whatever they're called. No, the baby oh, is right uh, the first time. In, it's an inhuman. No, it's Frank. No. <laughs> <laughs> it's all Disney now. It's all yes. Um, you know, Franklin from... Oh, Franklin, yes. Richards. Yeah, so, but... Man, they can do this. Well, if the whole Disney buys Fox thing goes, we can get Brad Bird in, have him do yeah. a Fantastic Four movie, and I would be fine with that. Oh yeah, um, no, but I'm I'm desperately awaiting the new Adventures of the Incredibles, um, so it's certainly going to get my money. Mm-hmm. Yeah, have, times. from from such a teasing teasing trailer to say you'd give it money this soon. It's really more a testament to the original than what the teaser showed, although the potential Mm -hmm. is so strong with it. It's like, yeah, no. It's like at the announcement, if we did an uh, announcement trashing, they're announcing this movie. Here, here's my cash. (laughs) (laughs) Oh, this is happening? Okay, yeah. So it's going to be some interesting things because, I mean, this could be a whole conflict in itself because... They weren't uh, the, obviously the teaser is shown otherwise, but they weren't initially aware of that Jack Jack had powers. So, and then a baby who can't control anything, much less he's still in diapers, so he can't really control anything. Uh, how, how's he going to deal with all these powers, you know, for a baby? So I'm sure that's going to be its own level of threat in itself. Yeah. Yeah. Absolutely. And I am excited for Frozone. I'm yeah, I say. was just about to say that. As long as Frozone's in it, makes a little cameo. And he is. All good. All good. Yeah. I, I just I just hope for another line along the level of, where is my super suit? <laughs> <laughs> that was the greatest scene of that yeah. movie. <laughs> yes. Where is my super suit? I would oh even be okay with being introduced to um, some more supers that mm-hmm. maybe were out there that, you know, did not meet their own de- demise in the in the first one. Be interesting. Think they'll form a super league? Right. That'd be nice. Sort of, yeah. An incredible league? Super society. Super cool guys. Where they'll avenge things. And their friends. <laughs> and their friends. <laughs> now, now see all this has inspired me I want an Avengers Incredibles crossover I don't care if it's a comics or film I want this to happen Disney that would be There's really cool you, you know how to make this happen <laughs> yeah yep. you got it all in house yeah, yeah it's, that, it's like, that would be very very cool yeah yep. all right. well this has definitely got my cash whenever the movie comes out I didn't even think I don't think it's said summer, June summer. 13, 2008 okay 18. Otherwise, we really missed it. <laughs> it's not getting like that. <laughs> 2018. It's got my cash. Oh, you're raining down on Incredibles too. That's right. Yeah, it's got my cash as well. Absolutely. Well, that's it. Yeah. Cash all around. Cash, 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 cash. Cash in it, cash in it. Well, as uh, short as the teaser was, so is this particular rendition of Trailer Trashin. So we're definitely going to see it, and we'll definitely be talking about it as the year goes on. So for the rest of us, it's all geek to us. Take care, you guys. See ya, see ya. change my box